I just want to ask you because you were talking about Tony Blair. Um, it was it was late one evening uh, back in early July. I tweet I think uh, Andrew that you tweeted bring back Blair. I wondered how your campaign to to bring back Tony Blair was going. Do you, do you think Labour would be doing better now if Tony Blair was leader of the Labour Party? Oh yeah, I think if Tony Blair was leader of the Labour Party, we'd be competitive with Boris Johnson for winning the next election. Indeed, I'd love to see Tony stand in Sedgefield, which I think he would win back the Labour with uh, with a big uh, charismatic and vision thing for the whole future of the North East. On this point about, I, the point about Brexit is quite important because uh, I think Seb is himself a Brexiter, so I think he's slightly coloured by that. No, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang uh, on. Seb is shaking uh, his head on this. That's not... But, but anyway, whether he, can, he can reply to that in, in, in a moment. <laughs> <laughs> but, but the point about it is it's the leader. If you follow his own logic, it's the leader that matters. So the fact that Keir Starmer may have had a different position from Jeremy Corbyn doesn't alter the fact at all. The reason why Labour crashed and burned in both 2017 and 2019, and remember, it did really badly in 2017 too, where it was still 100 seats fewer than Tony Blair had been in his last election. The reason it did really badly was because of the leadership of Jeremy Corbyn, who on this big issue of Brexit in the 2019 election abstained.